Hello guys, this is Blake and I'm back with a ground war domination on invasion. And I'm using uh the UMP forty five Marathon Lemon Commando, which is the biggest tryhard gun ever, but I don't know. I guess I kinda like it, but it's really because it's really easy to use and I just pull up my one man army sniper class, see if I can pick off one guy and I just get hit markers. And then I actually I eventually kill somebody. And then I switch to my uh, UMP class. But today, like, I was watching this video on the new map pack that's coming out. I'm sure lots of people have seen it by now. It is, uh, the, the map's called, or the map pack's called Escalation. And I will hope, I will try to put, like, a link to where, like, they show the four maps. They don't, like, there's no trailer yet or anything, or at least that I know of. But I'll link you to like a picture where they show the four maps. Of like there's like zoo, convoy, hotel, like uh survive and some and I don't know what the other one is. But I'll try to put a link to that so you guys can go check it out, it's pretty cool. And that I just get so unlucky that that guy just pulls he just like comes around the corner and right as I get done with my predator. But, in, like, honestly, the connection you have makes, a, like, the biggest difference ever. Like, you wouldn't think it, but, like, I just got, like, my internet fixed, so I, I don't have, like, zero bars all the time, because that's what I usually do. But it is honestly, like, the biggest difference ever. Like, it's so much easier to play when you're host or, like, have a really good connection. Because, like, the bullets just, like, connect, and, like, your knives actually kill people, like, I'll be, I was playing today, and I knifed some guy, and like three seconds later, he shoots at me, and he gets a kill. Because my connection was lagging so bad. Because my internet is horrible, but I was trying to record with audio with my Turtle Beaches, but in, if anybody knows how to do that, like, correctly, <coughs> excuse me, but if anybody knows how to record with their tur Turtle Beaches correctly, uh, please message me because I tried it and it didn't work. I plugged like the USB and the audio jack in and it didn't even like do anything. And look at that pro. Bling, bling sniping with the sound, so we're a pro. But anyways, if anybody knows how to do that, just message me. Because like whenever I commentate, it sounds like I'm 12 and I, and I, it sounds like I have gum in my mouth. I'm like, yeah. And I'm just like, <laughs> you can hear like, I don't know what it's called, but it's just like really annoying. I want to get a microphone that actually works, or just use my turtle beaches if I can, because I don't know it's not working. But anyways, back back on the map pack topic, like there are like the four maps, like I was or the five maps pack like I was talking about, and it's gonna be it's probably gonna be fifteen dollars. There wasn't a uh, like a price on the picture that I showed you, but. Like, it, that's kind of high, like, I think it is, but, like, some people think it's not, like, I was watching x Jaws's video on where it said, like, it, they put a lot of thought, or, like, a lot of time and thought into the game, but, like, I agree with that, but, honestly, it's, like, $15 for five maps, five maps that I won't even play, or at four I won't, I'll only play, like, the Zombies one, and, like, that's what most people actually buy them for, like, Either like lower the price like to ten bucks so you can get like two with fifteen hundred Microsoft points instead of just like wasting that five bucks because it only costs twelve hundred and you get, like sixteen hundred in a pack. So like either do that, make it ten dollars, or just make more zombies maps because that's what honestly most people buy them for. That's what I bought the first one for because I don't play multiplayer on Black Ops because I just I don't like it. It's just not for me, but some people do. But like that's those are like the two options I would like to see done is like make it cheaper to change like have more zombie maps and the the zombie map is supposed to be survive like the call of the dead thing but like this might sound really stupid but I think they might have two zombie maps in it because like there's four there's five there's five pictures of the maps on the poster or whatever you call it and like there's one big one that's named like zoo that's like the big one and then the rest four are uh the rest four of them are multiplayer maps but like like it just like i think it would be different because 
I think Zoo would be the zombies map because it's bigger than all the rest. Like, why would they make one multiplayer map bigger than the rest unless it's like a different kind of map? But that's just like what I think. I don't know if anybody else like everybody else probably thinks I'm really stupid because that like reasoning. But I honestly would like to see at least it'd be cool if they were both zombie maps, but. I always see like Zoo be the zombie map then survive because it just looks like like who doesn't want to play a zombie map that's named Zoo? I mean honestly. Like the dogs could be like tigers and like animals could come out instead of like dogs or monkeys, they could like mix it up. But I was I would like to like see like the special things they did in the first map pack. Map pack where like each uh each map had like their own special thing. Like Kowloon had the zip line uh, Berlin Wall had the No Man's Land where, uh, you run out and die. And then Discovery had, like, the Falling Bridge, or, like, you can break it, and then Stadium, oh, I don't think Stadium had anything, but I would like to see more of that. Like, maybe I'd actually play the maps if they were good. Because, honestly, I don't really like any of the Black Ops maps besides Fire Range and Nuketown, but Nuketown got taken out of domination. I don't know why, because, like, I guess people couldn't capture the flags, like, fast enough. Like, the best thing, the most probably fun I had in Black Ops was, like, that 24-7 Nuketown. If anybody's played it, you know that that was, like, the funnest time ever. Like, me and my friends would we would actually play Black Ops because it didn't suck because the map was actually good. Like, it'd just be all Nuketown. It was only for, like, a weekend, too. I mean, like, if you want, I don't know why they would take something off like that, but, like, that's just, like, the funnest, like, map ever. I think everybody thinks that's the best map, so why wouldn't you keep it? I honestly would probably play it a lot more if it was just if there was 24/7 Nuke Town, but they didn't listen to me, which no one does. But like, this is a pretty long video; it's 10 minutes in. For like the new zombies map, I'd like to see, or uh, I'd like for them to like take out monkeys because like I don't really like them because you can you can be like going solo and you basically have to protect Jug, Juggernaut. Because, like, or else, because a billion monkeys come to Juggernaut and it, and I don't know why it gets taken in, like, uh, like, it gets taken in, like, two hits when, like, all the other ones get taken in, like, 30. Like, it just makes no sense. Like, why would the most valuable perk be, like, so easy to lose? Maybe because they want to make it harder or something. But I would like to see monkeys gone, like, replaced with something else. Like, maybe they could take your, uh, like, not your gun, but I don't know what else. Have, they could take out your grenades or something stupid like that. Like something that's not like valuable and can like kill you easily. Like or it could take like your gun, it could take your gun or the uh and here I'm just jumping around hoping to get like one of these guys and I actually did. Or it could take like they could take your pack a punch if you did have a pack punch. But I would like to see like you know how they there are drops after every like monkeys, dogs or the the scientists that of five like after every one of those I would like to see like a different power up like in five there's like you could get bonfire sale fire sale and max ammo like all together and if you don't like if you haven't played five months uh bon or fire sale is like when each box is only ten dollars and they the boxes spawn like in every room and that's like one of my favorite power up things and bonfire sale would is where you can pack a punch for a thousand dollars, which is like really good deal. I don't know why it's like a really good deal. It's not like it's actual money, but like if you don't have enough money, like to pack a punch, you can just use. You can wait till bonfire sale to do it. Like, but you have to kill the scientists first, which is kind of hard if you're like playing with only one person. Like, I would like, I would like to see them make like it the same difficulty as if you had four people, than if you had one person. Like. With with four people, it's so much harder because there's three like million zombies spawn, and it's just like if you get to like round thirty, it's gonna take like two two and a half hours, which is like ridiculous. Really long. Like when you could get to thirty by yourself, it's gonna take like an hour to like forty five minutes. Like it's it is not gonna take that long with why with wild solo, and I just like to, I'd like to see that too. I'd like to see more. I'd like to see more rape train spots like in. I had I got the uh, the hardened edition maps in. There were literally like no rape train spots to do that like on those maps, but they're so fun, you know. That like it's something different and like on Kin Kinder Tone, there's that one spot and on the stage or the theater, 
like where you could do it. But like I wasn't really good at that spot. I don't know why, because I was backed up into something. There was like so many different things, like boxes or whatever you could hit. But I'd like to see uh, like a big first room or like like in Ascension, where like is you start on black and white. Like I don't know why people didn't like that. It honestly wasn't that big of a deal. Like I don't honestly it like didn't make the game any better or worse. It was just like normal. But I don't know, people, some people didn't like that, but that's just me. But the game's coming to a close here soon. And I'll just keep talking about uh, the map pack. But I'll leave a link in the description of like where to find like the map pack picture. And I hope like, Treyarch releases a map pack trailer soon because like they released the poster. Or they didn't release the poster, it got... Like somebody released released it for them or like found it and then released it and then like see my final score is like fifty nine and like fifteen or so and I can't really see on this small screen but I was one away from sixty I would have gotten that guy if it wasn't for my the game ended that second but so uh, see you later guys peace.